welcome back. Today I wanted to create for you another makeup look, but I wanted to make this a little more colorful, more bolder, and I used the Vice 3 from Urban Decay. Now I haven't mentioned this palette before just because I've had so much going on and I almost forgot that I had gotten this palette. This palette was a gift for me for my birthday. I got it in December from one of my very best friends. And I have to say that I have fallen completely in love with this palette. I couldn't stop using it for the entire month of December. And I created this look among so many other looks that I want to go ahead and feature also on my beauty channel. So yeah, if you'd like to see how I completed this look, then go ahead and keep on watching. Alright guys, so first we're starting off by priming our eyes and I'm taking the Urban Decay Original Primer Potion and this will just ensure that I have no creasing throughout the day and my eyeshadows will stay nice and vibrant. Next I'm moving on to my beautiful Vice 3 palette and I'm taking the first shade which is Downfall and that's on the very left side and that'll be my transition color. Next I'm taking the shade Freeze and I'm taking a flat shader brush for this one and just packing that all over my lids. Going back in with my blending brush, I'm just going to blend out any harsh lines. Next I'm going to take some tape and what you want to do is just take a piece of tape and just put it on the back of your hand and this will remove the stickiness that you get from that tape because we don't want to pull that right off of our skin on our eyes because our eye area is very very gentle. So we want to go ahead and just place that where you want your sharp line and you want to make sure you try to make them as even as you can so they don't look like there's much of a difference. And then I'm taking the shade Heroin and it's this beautiful matte blue and I'm taking a crease brush from the Lace and I'm just going to concentrate this into the outer corner and buff this also into the crease and then I take my blending brush and just go back in and buff out any harsh lines. And then I like to go back in and just retouch up the shade Freeze on my lids. And then I went ahead and did the very same thing on the next eye and placed the tape just to line it up to make sure I've got my line really well. And then I went in with Heroin and just did the same thing I did as the other eye. And you want to make sure through each step you want to go back and blend in between shades. That way it'll minimize the harshness of the buffing out and just making the any harsh lines just buffed out and blended out really well. And that's what I'm doing here. I'm just buffing out any harsh lines. You want to make sure you blend. You can never do too many too much <laughs> you can never do too much blending. And then I'm taking a bobby dazzle just to highlight the inner corners of my eyes. And then I'm going in and doing my wing liner and this is also a good technique if you have trouble perfecting your wing liner. I'm using the Jessie's Girl eyeliner in black and if you just line it against the tape you can easily just pull the tape right off after you complete your liner and get that really sharp line that you really want. And then I went back in with my blending brush just to blend out any harsh lines. And then of course I hit my top lashes and my bottom lashes with the Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara. I did apply my Demi 120 lashes by Ardell off camera just because I was having trouble. And then I did apply liner on the bottom by Too Faced. And then I went ahead and put on the Naked Shade Urban Decay Revolution lipstick. This has been one of my favorites throughout the year. And this completes the final look.
it for today's makeup look. I really hope you guys enjoyed watching it. I really hope that you guys enjoyed the color choices that I made for this makeup look. Leave any comments or any thoughts that you may have. And don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And until my next video, I'll see you guys soon. Bye! So I went ahead and just created this like...